So you so you got all this bunch of random lures what you got from the bait tackle shop. All of this okay so you you're why we wonder so you don't know what do you use them, what days is the best time to use and we're gonna uh explain this all uh, we're gonna go uh little by little on 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 this uh today's uh video to start off we're gonna take a look on spinners spinners are excellent baits for a uh, bass pike walleye maybe and also smallmouth and you can use them uh during sunny days uh also you can do it um in dirty water or stained waters and also there's different types of uh, spinners there's white green red black then uh, after that then we're gonna go to the next two is uh realistic lures we got a couple of them right here and a couple of them right here so we're gonna start off right here this is uh on a underrated or I say worse lure it depends uh if you use it uh, these are excellent uh similar as the spinner uh spinner baits it's a good condition for you can catch bass walleye and pike panfish similar to this similar to this lure also uh this one's gonna be exact similar but walleye it's gonna be you can catch similar but except for this you can catch walleye uh, bass pike maybe crappie and crappie maybe and then we're gonna we're gonna move up uh, to our, our to uh, sp uh to spinners right here These are excellent uh, baits for trout, wall of a pike, panfish, trout, and and pike. There's different colors. There is uh, a silver one, and also a colorful one. Then we're gonna go next to uh, the second, like what I said, the second one. This is uh, this one is like exactly similar what I said to over here. This is really good for uh, pike, bass, walleye, musky maybe. This is excellent lures for for pike, walleye, and bass. Similar as this one. Then we're gonna go up to uh to its um uh soft plastics. That's right here, and then right here. Uh, some of them. Okay, first we're gonna start up right here. This is a small the small one. Uh, you can do it. On, you can put this on curly tails. You can put this on curly tails. Of, uh, mostly you can put on on. Uh, on this uh, warm thick uh uh warm i don't know if it's warm or not but similar as this this also also we can after that next we're gonna talk about crankbaits and chat uh crankbaits and jerk baits First, we're gonna start with our uh, crankbaits. Crankbaits are uh, uh, excellent lures, such as this one. Uh, you can, uh, for this one, you can catch as walleye, bass, pike, trout, panfish. Unless this is a miniature size, something like this. Similar to this, you can catch pike. Similar as this, and bowfin also. Ignore this. That's that's for ice fishing lures. We're not gonna do it. Uh, I don't post any ice fishing videos. But this year, uh, on 20, 000, 2023 and twenty four, we're gonna do with my best friend, uh, buddy Jacob. This, uh, his channel is F Fishing Winter Outdoors. Uh, this is his channel. I'm gonna post it in my the comments. Now we're gonna talk about is uh, bass jigs. Bass jigs are awesome, are excellent, uh, 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 good lures for, uh, for, like I said, bass, 
I don't know about pike. Only the large amount of bass and smallies. No, so uh, all the, like what I said, you can use them uh during you can toss them uh, uh like between relines. I think. Then we're gonna talk about jerk baits. Jerk baits right here. Jerk baits are excellent lures for walleye, pike, and bass. Crappie also. Those are excellent baits. Oh yeah, about this right here. About we're gonna go back to the uh to this. Uh, this can dive uh, up to uh eleven to twelve feet deep maximum, unless you have a, like a swivel on. Only uh, with this type of this type of swivel right here. This is a good one for and also this one maximum at least five uh five feet. Similar as this one, unless if you attach a swivel, you can deepen more. We're gonna talk about bigger crankbaits. Also, maximum at least uh, at 10, 10 to 12 feet deep. If you put a uh, swivel on, it can deep uh, can deep dive more. We're gonna talk about realistic lures. Right here, I don't know it's a good. Uh, Good game bait. Uh, this is a, a realistic lure. Uh, this can catch bass, pike, walleye, bowfin. Uh, maybe some uh white bass. Who knows? Similar as this one. Similar as this one. And this is a really good bait. You can toss. Uh, you can cast them anywhere. I like in and deep structures. Then we're gonna after that we're gonna move up to jigs. We're gonna first we're gonna talk about the net rig. The net rig is uh is the best is some um, excellent lure for bass, maybe pike, crappie. Pretty sure not panfish cause maybe. Uh eh, maybe, who knows? We're gonna take look smaller ones. Like what I said. Most of them are multi-species, but this, most of them are for panfish, bass, and walleye. But, uh, except for this one, because this is a multi-species, it means you can catch bass, perch, uh, perch, uh, bluegill, um, what's it called, crappie, and maybe pike on this? I don't know, but... Most of them are for walleye, but and also here's another one. Crappie. This is only for crappie. Okay, next up the chatterbait. Chatterbaits, this is the only single chatterbait where we have. But chatterbaits are excellent baits for bass. Just for bass, I think. But I'm not pretty sure though. But also and then after that we're gonna move up to uh uh topwater lures. Like frogs. But I don't know this one looks like a bigger the carp. But anyways, but these are excellent baits for bass, pike. I don't know about walleye though, but bowfin. I'm pretty sure and that I'm pretty sure that's all. Also, uh, these are excellent baits though. I'm not lying though because they're uh, they're also true. And also, don't forget about this one. Uh, this can catch freshwater drum. Don't forget about also this one. You can catch a uh, musky. You can catch musky, pike, walleye. Oh, this one is a multi-species lure, a uh, uh, lure. And then we're gonna uh, go up to the next to the whopper, a uh, plopper. Whopper ploppers are an uh, insanely uh good uh real good lures because uh because one of the videos I watched last time I was showing uh this guy was trying to catch a whale's catfish. Do you, you do not know a whale's catfish? A whale's catfish is a uh, native species lure in Europe, I think. And also they uh they are huge, absolutely giant. They can weigh up to over a uh, 200 pounds. They can grow up at least uh up to uh more than 12 feet long, I think. And also we're going to take a look at another musky lure. Let me show you. Aha, uh -huh, right here. Here's a muscular 
musky uh are d this is good uh, uh not easy uh this is uh lure for musky pike walleye and also may uh also uh some catfish flatheads i i don't know about what it said but musky yeah for trolling yes and that's all what it got for today's video and also give uh give up a thumbs uh, give us a thumbs uh, thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Also, uh there's a video that I we need to reach to a hundred likes that we can uh get a a uh ugly uh silk uh uh ultralight uh because uh we uh we made a bet uh we ch I don't know what to say though but anyways. But I'm gonna post uh, those two uh, links with my best uh, friend buddy Jacob's channel and also uh, the video that I uh, want you to get a hundred likes on. See ya. Bye.